Yeah. It was me. And now... Eh? Hey guys, what is up? It's Cherry Dirt here, and today... We're gonna be reading a spoopy story. I've been wanting to do one of these for quite some time, but just never got around to it. Wasn't sure if you guys would be interested in them, so we're just giving it a go today. If you guys wanna go check out the app for yourself, it's on the App Store, it's called Must Read. I am using this obviously on iPhone, I don't know if it's on Android, so I'm sorry, but there's loads of cool apps that have these type of spoopy stories in that you can go check out. This one's called Escape, and I'm gonna be reading it all. Although where we're escaping from, I have no idea. Help! I'm kidnapped! Oh no, this is not a good start, is it? Answer, please! Who's this? Rupert Marrow. A psycho kidnapped me! He keeps me locked for months! I don't even know the date now. Don't know you. But I'm begging you, please help! Oh, I get to decide! Hmm, decide what will happen. Is it a joke? I'm calling the cops. Um, I mean, honestly, if this was real life, I would be a bit like, is this like a prank? Shall I? I'll say it's a joke. Maybe? Oh no, I'm gonna pick the wrong thing. Is it a joke? No! I'll prove it. Oh no. Oh, what the heck? What? Alright. Please help me. He accidentally left his phone here. Oh, okay. He'll be back when he notice. We don't have time. Please. Where did you get my number? I texted randomly. Why didn't you call the cops? No, don't. Why? They're all bribed. Oh, what is going on? Please believe me. I have no one to turn to. Don't you have any relatives? Not really. What do you mean? He staged my death. What is this story already? I'm so <laughs> confused. So no one was looking for me. What the... Oh, why did he do all this? He's insane! He's doing experiments on me. Okay, what on earth? Okay, so he's locked up this, this random person that's texted me. Locked up and he's getting experimented on. What? What? For months. And if I text my family now, they won't believe. They'll think it's a damn joke. Just as you do. Or well, if it's true, I feel really sorry for you, man. But what do you want from me? Find me and get me out of here. Please. How? Where? I'm a well-known artist. Okay. I have money. That's not That's not really... I mean, honestly, if someone was in trouble, it, it wouldn't be a case of money for me, but okay. If you save me, I'll pay you back big. I promise. Just do not involve the cops. See, why would he think that the cops are bribed? So who is he? I don't know his name. Very helpful, okay, right, we're on to a good start. Can you describe the person? No. Okay, right. Do you know where you are? No. Right, well, that's a dead end then. <laughs> I tried to escape once. <gasps> okay, all right, I'm ready. I'm intrigued, okay. There were canyons all around and not a soul. I was running down the river for hours. Then I saw a man. He called the cops. They were there in an hour. Picked me up and drove back here. I really don't know how I can help. Well, there was a waterfall in the canyon. What is this, Batman's lair? What is going on here? Big, beautiful. I guess I saw some pics of it. It must be a popular place. I'm not good with geography. I'll try to Google it. This one? Ooh, pretty. No, that- it's Niagara Falls. Look for the canyons around. Whoa, that's pretty. Oh, okay, that looks- oh, I'm loving that. Can I go there, please? Sorry, this isn't the time, of course. <laughs> yes, this is it. You're in Arizona. Grand Canyon. A couple hours from the fall. Please find me. I'll pay. Oh, wow, that's a lot of money. Oh my goodness. That's all I've got. What do you mean that's all you got? Oh, he's coming back. 15 minutes later. He was looking for the phone. I hid it well. I think he believed he left it somewhere else. I'm begging you. Get me out of here. He's torturing me. I can't stand it anymore. You'll save my life and make good money. Please. Listen, I feel really sorry. But why don't you try texting your family? Send them a photo. They'll know it's not a joke. They'll be shocked at first, for sure. Then they'll be glad to know you're alive. And they'll get you out. It's not that simple. What are you talking about? Yeah, I'm a bit confused at this point. He changed you? What? Okay, now he's like a, a real life Frankenstein. I don't know what to do with this information. So he's like proper experimented on him. And he's like changed. 
I'm guessing this is more of a physical change as well? This does not sound good. Oh yeah, we're confused. My family won't recognize me. Did he do something bad? Well, not exactly. Google my name. You'll see what I looked like before. Oh, nice picture. <laughs> yeah, it was me. And now, eh? All right, okay, so not quite what I was thinking. He's a girl now? Is that is that what I'm getting from this? So really, really wouldn't recognize like at all. Interesting, huh? What? Who's this? It's me. He's changed my sex. Performed plastic surgery. For real? That's why I can't text my family. Who's gonna believe their son is back to life? In a body of a woman. What? Why did he do that? I told you, he's a psycho. Uh, no other explanation, he's a psycho. That's it, done, dusted, all right. That's, that's what we're gonna believe now. He's dressing me up, doing my hair. So he's turned you into a real life Barbie doll? This, is that what I'm getting now from this? I'm his toy. Okay, yep. Okay, he's a real life Barbie doll now. If you don't help me, there's only one way out for me. Okay, okay, I'll help you. But how will I find the place you're kept? Uh, track my phone. I know one guy who might be able to help with that. Well, don't tell him about me. Don't tell anyone. Well, don't worry, I trust him. Anyway, be careful. Okay, I'll text back later. Sometime later. We found you! <gasps> no way! No way! Wow, that is pretty. Okay, so there's like loads of different houses here. Interesting. So how are they going to know exactly which one? Thank God, thank you. Yeah, but what's next? How will I get in? I'll come up with something. He lets me out for walks sometimes. If I behave, I'll run. Just wait for me nearby with a car. Everybody in! <laughs> oh my goodness, this is insane. How will you do that? Leave it to me. Please, come soon. I'll be there in two hours. Thank you. I'll never forget that. Oh, oh my goodness! In an hour. Oh! Oh my goodness, we are legging it. We are so legging it. Oh my gosh. So, we actually find a house. Is this actually gonna work? Is this gonna be a prank? I'm confused. I ran! How? He let me out. Then someone called. He went outside. So I ran, but when I was climbing over the fence... Ooh, ouch. Where are you? I'm 50 miles to the north. Highway 52. I'll run to you. Oh my goodness. How far away are you running from? Jeez. I won't get close to the road. I don't want to get noticed. Half an hour later. Oh my goodness. I can't walk anymore. I've lost too much blood. Oh my goodness. I'm close. Where are you? What's that sound? Siren? I don't hear anything. It's cops. They're after me. Are you- are you cr what? What? Faster. I'm at the river bend. I'm coming. Oh my goodness, this is gonna be a tight one. They're closer, hurry. Well, I'm here. Where are you? I can't see you. I'm behind the rocks. Hurry, they're here too. I'm running to you. Don't worry, Mary. Help is here. How did you call me? No! No! What? The next day? How's she? What the heck? Her arm is getting better. Unfortunately, that's the only piece of good news. How many more tries do you want to make? I think that's it. Obviously, therapy isn't enough in this case. She still thinks her sex and appearance was changed, calls herself the name of her husband, and believes his death was staged. Every time she finds the cell, she texts the same number. The number of her son. The son who crashed with her husband? Yes. We've tried it all, but there's no progress, and she's dangerous. Firstly, for herself. I think there's only one option left. Do I want to click on this? I feel like I don't want to click on this video. Oh my goodness, what time was this set in? No, what, no, what time is this set in? Okay, this has got to be like more of an older thing because that's not, that's not really, okay. Well, okay, this is something else, isn't it? Oh no, that was the end, that's crazy. What the heck? I like that story. Such a twist at the end as well. We thought it was obviously someone else and it's just a reoccurring thing. Like she's struggling with things. Oh my God, it's insane. That is actually crazy. I figured as we're getting more into the spoopy month that uh, I figured I'd give this a go and, and read some scary kind of stories. If you guys want me to do more of these type of things, let me know in the comments. 
I'm guessing this was set into a more older time because that's not really a thing anymore. And it's just so interesting that that used to be. If you look into asylums and things like that from years ago, it's very interesting. If you like these kind of things and you'll like some of my other videos that I've done in the past, so definitely go check those out. Like I said, there's things floating around me and plus there's some stuff in the description if you haven't already gone and seen those. It's bad because I'm recording this at night. It is gone past 12 and I am a little bit, well, I'm officially freaked out. So I'm gonna try and go to bed and have lots of nightmares. Okay, bye-bye. <laughs>